want to say no but you said yes ah! you really hate it when you say yes to something that you really want to say no to that used to be me i'm going to share what i do first thing call in a spirit guide to help you i work with bear and wolf for this purpose imagine them being with you when you're going to put up a boundary Practice this in non-stressful situations so you really get used to what that feels like. Why would you do this? These animals embody strength, courage, they know how to protect their territory and their resources without fear, blame, shame or guilt. And that energy can inspire you to do the same. Here are some phrases I use, you might find these helpful. When someone asks you for something that you don't want to give, imagine your animal and try a simple phrase. That doesn't work for me and then state your need clearly and assertively without apologising or explaining. For example, I have a need to keep that money for my own bills and expenses so I can't give it to you. I need to keep my car available for me so I cannot lend it to you. I'm not able to be present for you or your kids this week. I have other things that I am doing with my time. Your need trumps their need and you can express that through your language. You don't have to explain or justify and calling in those guides can really help with that. If someone gets upset and tries to guilt trip you, that's a them problem, not a you problem. Nope. You are not responsible for other people's emotions or their expectations. You deserve to be valued for who you are, not what what you can give. So set those boundaries and let your wolf or bear or whatever animal comes forward roar within you and support you to make these changes in your life.